Nothing, nothing. I love comedy, and I interview comedians, and here's my left hand watching. You got it. It's Donna. Hello, everybody. I am the Comedy Nut, and this is my interview with... Sean Donnelly. Sean Donnelly. <laughs> Sean Donnelly. You're a stand-up comedian. Yes. If you could tell any joke in the world, which would it be? If I could tell any joke in the world? I don't, that's a hard question. I, you mean like jokes I'm, that I haven't told yet? Any joke in the world, which would it be is what it says. Oh, which would it be? I, I, I would just tell knock-knock jokes. When you think of a joke, what is it like? It's like thinking you're, it's like feeling like a genius. You feel like a genius when you figure out a joke. No, you have a really <laughs> funny joke about the bath mat. Yes. I love the bath mat joke. And when you thought of that joke, you were like, I'm a genius? Yes. That's how. Yes, I did. I thought I was a genius when I thought of the bath mat joke. I thought you were a genius when you thought of it too, because I just yeah. love it. How old are you? I'm 38. <laughs> 38 years young. What is your, what is your day job? My, my day job? Yeah. I am an entrepreneur. Did you ever tell a joke by accident? Yes. Really? Yeah, Did totally. it hurt anyone? No, it did not hurt anybody. Telling a joke by accident, how would that hurt somebody? Here are some tough questions. You're Irish. Why? Because that's where my ancestors were born. Mm. My great, do you have, what nationality are you? I'm Czechoslovakian. <laughs> What's your last name? Nut. N Nut, that's Czechoslovakian? Nut. Was that short for something? It obviously was changed. Right, 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 right. You're married. Yes. Does your wife know you're a comedian? Uh, yes, she does. She knows full well I'm a comedian. She does? Yes. And how did she find out? She came to a show. We got to talk about me being a comedian. Mm -hmm. I tried to stop, but I couldn't. Have you, got, have you overcome it? No, I'm still a comic. Why aren't there more dog cat comedy teams like Garfield and Odie, Milo and Otis, and the Incredible Journey crew? Were Milo and Otis a comedy team? They were a dramedy. You think Heathcliff and Garfield will get along? Heathcliff and Garfield look like the same thing. They do. Like, Wasn't Heathcliff like the no frills Garfield? I think so. That's like, what I thought of it. Yeah, well, yeah, like if you went to Pathmark, you yeah. get you get Heathcliff. Yeah, Heathcliff is like j this box with just the word cereal on it. Oh, <laughs> cat, cartoon <laughs> cat, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Now you have been on the the dumbest criminal show. <laughs> Which dumbest criminal is having the best week ever? <laughs> Which dumbest criminals having the best week ever? I, I don't know. Uh, Casey Anthony? What's Tanya Harding's best joke? I, I don't know. I've, I've, hey, I've never seen Tanya Harding tell a joke. Have you ever hit a comedian in the knee? <laughs> yes, I have. You have? But which one? Nick Turner. No, which knee? Oh. <laughs> the, the, right, the right knee. Ah, that makes No, I don't mean the right knee. I mean the, the right knee to hit. Could you just do me a favor and do one of your comedy jokes in front of a stage? No. Okay. <laughs> anyway, I was worth a try, right, guys? See you later. See you next time. Bye. Thanks for nothing. <laughs> That's your catchphrase? Thanks for nothing? I guess so. <laughs> What's the funniest sound? Uh, kerplop. <laughs>